fuse box here and it is time to get your dragon team in check it doesn't really matter where you are tomorrow you need to be running dragon it's a this the last time on fire night they gave us a chance for a twice the chance for stun gear now we have twice the chance for speed gear the most coveted gear in the game and with this new fix that made the arena a little more competitive for everybody well that's how you compete in arena speed wins and so tomorrow we're gonna have twice the chance to get our speed gear from the dragons uh dragons keep so time to check where you're at uh let's let's kind of look at uh, let's get in there and, and see what 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 you want to be working for uh if you are any wherever you are do the best you can the the chance of better gear increases of course uh once you hit stage seven if you just started the game you can start getting up to five star gear big jump uh 10 where you stop getting three star is another big jump and probably the most substantial jump is when you hit stage 13 or higher you can now start getting six star gear six star speed gear comes with if you have speed on the substats the rolls on that speed can get high uh, it gets even better at 20 because at stage 20 no longer will you get four star gear five and six star complete completely usable gear is what you'll be getting uh, now the the new stage 21 through 25 basically 24 and 25 are gonna be the most optimal if uh, you know during a I'm sure everybody still has their fast uh, stage 20 teams uh, you know it takes me three and a half uh, almost four minutes to beat stage 25 but it's absolutely worth the run uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, if you have the right affinity for stage 24 on a poisoner or something then there's nothing wrong at all with running stage 20 it's actually too cheaper on energy and virtually the same but there's a slight uptick in getting six star legendaries on stage 25 uh, so if you've got a fast team that can get through through the waves easily and then kill the dragon that's a great way to go uh, I've got a video on one team that could be all 25 stages of all the dungeons uh, with one flex spot uh, so if you're still struggling to push through it you might check that out make some version of that team so that you can at least beat it if it takes you six seven minutes it's still worth doing it's gonna outpace the energy that's coming in while you're off and letting your game autoplay so definitely definitely you know something you want to you want to explore while you can if you can push further you're gonna have higher odds but if you're struggling in this area then there's nothing wrong with hitting stage 20 and just grinding away uh, but definitely getting that speed gear is going to make it a whole lot more competitive in uh, the arena so basically let's let's look at what you do why everybody loves speed gear so much go to your gear I do this once a week at least come in here and uh, hit filter go to sub 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 stats of speed I haven't slept much uh, close all your gear open up speed and also open up divine speed too. anything that has a sub stat of speed like right here I can't believe this isn't rolled up start rolling that stuff up and see if you hit speed once twice three times because your arbiter whoever your speed lead is or your speed booster look at that we hit one speed you want to have the most speed you can on them speed wins in arena uh, obviously you're gonna have nukers that you're gonna want high attack damage and stuff but uh you've got to outpace the other team or they're gonna lock you out they're gonna debuff you slam you kill you right so this is this is what you do i do this at least once a week i come through look at all my speed gear see what kind of rolls i get so this has 13 speed that's not a bad one uh, if it was six star that'd be much more much more but you never you never know when you're going to hit that triple roll at least go to eight see if you hit it once um because you want a minimum double rolls on speed we actually just got one and that's great and then you go through and you just basically make arbiter the fat it doesn't matter if she looked like a fifth grader woke up or a, a second grader woke up and dressed themselves <laughs> for school put that gear on her even if it's crit rate 
or crit damage on her gloves and she has no crit rate you just want speed so this one this one's definitely worth taking the 12 because we hit it once we can hit it twice and uh if it was again if it was a six star those rolls would be even higher that's why everyone's so excited about tomorrow uh definitely you should be getting ready for it come on this let me, let me open up omg quick and speed this up real quick where is there we go also if you have never gotten omg click this thing is absolutely amazing we'll real quick show how it helps so here's omg click you go to extras you hit enable let's let's find a piece of gear first and i'll show you how this works uh, if you don't have it go to get omgclick.com so we're about to roll this up you open up omg click hit enable and roll that sucker up to you can, you can go to 12 if you want there's no point in going to 12 on this one but it speeds everything up and then you turn it off and we're only going to get one roll at best here still a good piece of gear because when you're trying to speed tune those clan boss teams you're gonna have to have that gear all right disabled omg click real quick now on boots you're not looking for speed rolls uh you might be in a clan boss tuning speed or something but uh, you're looking for speed boots so the only other thing you have to do is go to boots primary speed and same thing of course they're probably all equipped but there's one might as well have this rolled up ready to equip because somebody's going to use it that's that's a guarantee speed boots are definitely the most coveted item in the game especially in the speed set so that's it short video hoping everybody has good luck uh, there are still what 13 sets of gear in the dragon dragon's lair so you know out of 13 sets at least there's twice the chance to get speed gear and when we went through that stun set it felt about right i definitely got more stun gear than i did the other gear so i hope that we all come home tomorrow evening and we have bags just full of speed gear to go through because it's it's one of my favorite things every when i'm cleaning my gear i always start with checking my speed gear rolling it up so that's it. Until next time, enjoy the grind.